Hi, can you show me Mercedes GLC 63S? Great choice, sir. Uh, and would you like to make the payment? Uh, do you guys take NFTs? You're joking, right? Uh, no, no, I just sold one for $1 million online. <laughs> Security? Yar, aur ek aa gaya. Nikalo isko bahar, yar. Among many elements of the crypto sector that have shown promise in recent times, non-fungible tokens or NFTs have emerged as a top investment category. NFTs, as we are now familiar with, are blockchain-backed digital collectibles which can be inspired by any thing. Be it a video clip of the game-changing moment in your favorite sport, or pictures of your sketches, or even your selfie. A lot can be converted into NFTs. Buying and selling NFTs exploded as a popular trend in 2021, churning some $25 billion. That's 1,84,690 crore rupees in sales value last year. Just recently, an Indonesian student hit himself a million dollar jackpot by selling a collection of 1,000 selfies. You heard it right. The collection was uploaded on OpenSea Marketplace with each NFT selfie priced at $3. That's roughly 225 rupees. At their highest, these NFT selfie pieces were sold for as much as $3,000. That's roughly 2 lakh rupees. And here's what those selfies look like. I mean, why didn't I think of this idea before? Anyway, I'm sure by now you're definitely wondering ki bhai, aakhir ye NFTs banai kaise jati hai? Welcome to Crypto Unfiltered. I'm Arun Singh, your host for this week, as Cyrus decided to take a small vacation. As you all need a break sometimes, right? This week, we tell you how you can try generating an NFT and maybe end up hitting the next big jackpot. NFTs ki baat kare, to unhe bohat sari dedicated online marketplaces mein bechne ke liye banaya jata hai. उदाहरण के तौर पर बात करें तो ओपन सी एक मशहूर अंतरराष्ट्रीय मार्केट प्लेस है इफ यू वॉन्ट टू नो हाउ यू कैन गेट योर क्रिएशन ऑनलाइन वाई एन एफ टीज देन ह्योर आर सम्पल स्टेप स्टेप नंबर वन डिसाइड वॉट यू वॉन्ट टू अपलोड एज योर एन एफ टी लेट्स गो विद स्केचेज यू मे हैव ड्रॉन मे बी द फर्स्ट स्टेप विल बी फॉर यू टू साइन अप विद एन एक्सचेंज प्लेटफॉर्म एंड सेट अप अ क्रिप्टो वॉलेट Coinbase, Rainbow, and MetaMask are some of the popular crypto exchanges whose wallets are supported by NFT marketplaces. Step number two: purchase some Ether tokens, which will come in handy as a gas fee or service fee that you will pay to the NFT marketplace you select. If you want to know what gas fee is, then check out our explainer on that on our YouTube channel. Now, check how much gas fee your preferred marketplace requires. And accordingly, purchase Ether tokens. Step number three: connect your wallet to your selected NFT marketplace. For extra security, you may be asked to scan a QR code to link your crypto wallet to the NFT marketplace. The marketplace can ask for its service fee before you list your collection or after your pieces have sold off, depending on its policies. Step number four: decide the price you want your NFT to be sold at. List its details like keywords, name, perhaps a story about it, and click on the create option. You'll then be asked to mint the NFT on a blockchain network, where again, you may be charged a gas fee depending on the marketplace policies. Once this gas fee is deducted from your wallet, your NFT is ready to be put up for sale. Fun fact, rapper Snoop Dogg is known to possess the world's most expensive NFT so far, which is priced at around $8.5 million. That's roughly 65 crore rupees. Try making an NFT and let us know in the comment section how it worked out. Now let's talk about the news of crypto. India has announced its plans of releasing a digital currency that will be regulated by the Reserve Bank of India. Finance Minister Nirmala Sitharaman also levied a 30% tax on incomes generated by virtual asset transactions. Industry insiders welcomed the decision and called it an indirect validation for the crypto sector. The classification of NFTs under the digital asset category remains a bone of contention in countries like South Korea and India. 
A group of Wikipedia editors have voted against categorizing NFTs as works of art. South Korean authorities are also dicey on their stance on whether or not to classify NFTs under the list of digital assets. Meanwhile, the profits and investments from the NFT marketplace space have also been echoing louder with each passing day. OpenSea's monthly sales volume crossed $3.5 billion, that's roughly 26,038 crore rupees for the first time. The crypto market remained impacted by fluctuations even as the first month of 2022 approached its end. Top ki do cryptocurrencies, Bitcoin or Ethereum, kuch zada badhautri dikhane mein asafal rahi and continue to register marginal losses on a daily basis as well. In fact, majority popular altcoins including Cardano, Ripple, Polkadot and Polygon also failed to make any substantial change in the volatile market movement. Dogecoin and Shiba Inu also continue to be traded at dipped values. The market sentiment seems to be getting better after the speculations of crypto ban in India did not see the light of the day. Industry experts believe that the crypto market is maturing at a healthy rate. Time to look at how major tokens are performing because as an investor, you need to keep an eye out on details like these. If we look at our crypto tracker for the week, we can see that Bitcoin is down by 3.27% and Ethereum is also struggling with a 2.93% drop. Tether seems to be doing a bit better with a 0.71% rise, but Cardano, Ripple and Dogecoin have all shown drops in the last 24 hours. It's going to be interesting to see what the future of crypto is going to be in India. If regulations are put in place, how will that affect investors? Stay tuned to this space for all the crypto gyan. That's it for Crypto Unfiltered this week. If you have any questions, send them across to us on our Twitter or Facebook pages. This is Arun Singh signing off and hopefully Cyrus will be back next week. I really hope. Thank you.